ओके इन दिस मैटलैब प्रोग्राम वी विल ट्राई टू वेरीफाई मैक्सिम पावर ट्रांसफर थ्योरम एज एन इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियर ऑल ऑफ यू आर अवेयर दैट मैक्सिमम पावर ट्रांसफर थ्योरम स्टेट्स दैट द पावर डिलीवर्ड टू द लोड रेजिस्टेंस इज मैक्सिमम वैन इट इज इक्वल टू द थेवन इन इक्वल इन रेजिस्टेंस ऑफ द नेटवर्क इन केस ऑफ ए डी सी नेटवर्क वाइल इन केस ऑफ एन ए सी नेटवर्क द मैक्सिमम पावर इज ट्रांसफर टू द लोड इम्पिडेंस वैन इट इज कॉम्प्लेक्स कंजुगेट ऑफ द थेवन इन इक्वल एंड इम्पिडेंस ऑफ द नेटवर्क सो फॉर द सेक ऑफ सिंप्लिसिटी लेट अस अज्यूम दैट वी आर हैविंग ए डी सी नेटवर्क हुज थेवन इन इक्वल एंड रेजिस्टेंस इज हंड्रेड ओम्स and we are having using a variable resistance load resistance whose resistance can vary from 50 ohms to 200 ohms in a step of 1 ohms so in order to verify the maximum power transfer theorem we have to prove that the power delivered to the load resistance that is rl is maximum when it is equal to rth that is 100 ohms which we have taken in this case so in this program we will define vm Is equal to 340 volts, and uh, let us take that Vm is AC supply. So RMS value will be 340 divided by square root 2, and RTH we are taking as 100 ohms, and RL we are taking as an area of 50 to 200 ohms in a step of 1 ohms. So IL load current will be VRMS divided by RTH plus RL, which will vary according to the load resistance RL. RTH is fixed. so load power is il square into rl next we will plot a graph between rl as we are varying the rl versus pl in black and we are using an asterisk sign so that we get the different samples on the plot again we hold on the plot and we write a title x label y label and using get text command we put that on the point where rth is equal to rl is equal to 100 ohms we will see how we will put this point and the power is maximum legend we are using as pl and we are turning on the grid for the ease of simplicity of marking that at what point we are getting the maximum power so when i run this program a maximum power transfer you can see this is the output figure which i am getting and it is clearly visible that at this point the point of my marker mouse the power is maximum i click on this and here now meta will write that rth is equal to rl is equal to 100 ohms and you can see grid wise also the power is maximum at 100 ohms below 100 ohms also power is decreasing and after 100 ohms also the load power is decreasing so hence we can say that maximum power transfer theorem is verified by using a simple matlab program like this you can verify other theorems also and you will observe that the result obtained are marvelous there is no need for detailed computation and graphing and plotting matlab automatically varies the value of rl takes different values and plots them puts them in the equation of pl and gives you the load relative power and lets you verify that at what resistance value you will get the maximum power thank you